All right, we're getting ready to adjust the valves on this inline 6250. You want to mark your distributor while you got the cap on it, and then come down and mark it with a white marker or something where you know your number one cylinder on top dead center. And then you want to make a mark on your number six, and you can adjust. The way we've done it, I've rolled it out so I ain't got to mess looking at the book. So we can adjust all our orange ones uh, while it's on the number one. And then we can adjust all our yellow ones when it's on the number six, top dead center. And we'll show you how to adjust one. spinning. Right there and quit spinning there is zero lash. Now you want to take, get wherever you want to do or need to be, get your ratchet right with you, and you want to make one full rotation. That's it. That's adjusted. Now we can adjust the intake on the number one. cylinders adjusted and then you go to the intake valve on number two, exhaust valve on number three, intake number four, exhaust number five, that'll have all your valves you adjust while you're top dead center on number one. And you rotate the engine to where you're top dead center on number six and you can adjust the number two exhaust, the number three intake, the number four exhaust, the number five intake and the intake and exhaust on number six cylinder. That's how you get your valves adjusted on these old 250s. That's it, thanks now.